All right, hey Virgo. So I am doing a spread for you guys. Uh, where is it going? All right, so this is, uh, you're dealing with somebody, you're not quite sure where what, what's happening here, where is it going? Um, kind of similar to, is this the one, but with a different layout of questions. All right, so you're gonna know this is your read from the start to the, to the finish. Um, and it's, it's an energy check-in. If you don't resonate with this, make sure you check your other placements. Um, and if you're new, welcome to the channel. Um, I hope you guys subscribe if you feel inclined. So I'm gonna get the uh, type of connection, the current status um, situation of the, the Virgo collectives that are drawn here. What is this? What's going on here for Virgo? All right. Here's what I feel. Um, we have the Queen of Wands and the Knight of Swords. So I feel like I could be dealing with a younger and an older person or um, an age gap that maybe um, uh, represents um, what you're not used to. All right. I don't feel like you're married, um, quite possibly. I don't even feel like you guys are fully committed. Um, I, what I feel is um, this is a situation that um, so I feel I almost feel like somebody is in this energy where it, it might be moving too fast because the Knight of Swords is a very hasty, fast energy. And then we have the Chariot. Um, it, it can be a representation of fast, but this is um, forward movement, moving ahead. It's a victory, it's a win. Um, but I almost feel like somebody could be in this energy where they're, they're not ready for it to go that fast, okay? But let's see what's going on with your energy. For Virgo, what is Virgo's, um, how to, let's see. How are you feeling? How's Virgo feeling about this connection, this person? All right. I feel like overall you're feeling pretty good about the connection. Um, if the if the haste is coming on your end or the fast movement you feel is coming on, um, I what I think is coming on your end. Um, it could be because you've recently walked away from somebody or this person has recently walked away from somebody. All right, we have the Nine of Cups coming out too. So I do feel like there is a sense of a wish um, fulfillment, all right, well, that you guys find within each other or um, that you find within this person. Um, but I, I'm almost feeling like if this person um, walked away from somebody, um, I almost feel like you you got to talk to him about that. You got to talk to them about the haste. I almost feel like it's this person moving fast. I don't, I don't know. I just feel like this person is leaving something um, and they, and they might have left it quickly. All right. Even though you feel really good about the connection, I feel like um, there's some words that you need to, you need to talk to. You need to tell this person um, because you don't want them to. You don't want the same thing happening to you. I almost feel like you're dealing with somebody who, who moves fast. Um, and Virgo, you don't move fast. You're not moving fast. That's not your style. All right. Um, but I kind of see um, because you, you want to achieve happiness. You want to achieve um, wish fulfillment with somebody. So you could see this person's energy as they like to move fast. And that's not something that you're, you're I'm, not, I'm not feeling that energy on your end. I'm feeling it on their end. So let's see what the mutual energy is between you guys. All right. The mutual energy. All right. So I do feel with the four of swords, um, this, I, this is, um, a representation of, of um, somebody who's been through a lot that, that does need to heal, all right? To me, this is being on a break. Um, I don't so much feel like that's what you, I don't feel like that's the conditions um, between you two, all right? But I feel like for somebody to be um, at their peak vibration, um, to embody divine masculine energy, and I almost feel like it is the masculine who is moving too fast in this relationship. Um, I almost feel both of you mutually know that there's healing that needs to, to take place before um, commitment can be offered, all right, in this connection. I feel like you both know it, okay? And I feel like um, quite possibly this person's going to feel it even more after you talk to them about um, the, the situation that they, 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 that they left. I feel like this, the divine masculine, I feel like 
um, because that's what the magician represents is uh, divine masculine energy. I feel like that's the one that might need to heal. All right, before this takes place, and I feel like they they already know, but I feel like um, that's business is going to happen when you bring it to um, their attention. All right, um, it's not that you're trying to push them away, um, but you're not dumb either. You want this to last. All right, so let's just see what their energy is. What is this person's energy? They want to come at you. They want to, you make this person very happy. I'm sorry, you, you make this person very happy. Um, and I do feel like with the Four of Pentacles, all right, and that Four of Swords, this person recognizes where healing needs to take place and they want to heal it because you make them. I, I feel like this is energy because of you. We have the Knight of Cups coming out. Um, this is a very tender, loving energy, all right? I want to take you on a date. I want to make love to you, not have not F you, you know? Um, they, you make them very happy, all right? Where um, they probably have experienced a little bit of imbalance in the past. You balance this person out and they see this as a success. They see you guys as a team uh, moving forward. So let's see how they feel about you and this connection. Look at this. Here's, a, I'm just going to tell you this. Divine Feminine now coming out on the bottom of the deck. Okay. But how do they feel about you in this connection? Um, where, where I feel maybe life has not been super fair to this person. They see you as a, um, a catalyst for change. They see you as a rebirth. They see you as a breath, a breath of fresh air. All right. You're coming at them in this light with the sun you you put a lot of this um a lot of their shitty past um you 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 make them want to flush it away if that makes sense okay and i feel like they see you as a very strong individual so i don't know what you guys have talked about i don't know what your intimate conversations have been but this person there's a lot of yellow um yellow is a very happy color all right and this person sees you as as a, a light um in their life you take you take pain away from this person um so let's just see where they see this going where does this person see this connection going oh they got the victory look at this oh wow and there's your emperor so we're seeing all kinds of things show up so where do they see this going the tower card um, you, you are the catalyst for positive change and, and forward growth. All right. In this person's um, life, they had to experience the tower. And if anything, you've um, awakened them. All right. To, to see why we go through things, why we experience toxic and karmic relationships, why we should slow down healing ourselves. All right. They see you as a catalyst for positive change and, and they see like they're there. You inspire this person. All right. And if anything, this person's probably talking in different ways since they've met you. Um, I, I can almost see this person kind of uh, mirroring or, or um, copying, you know, you and your lingo, some things that you say, passages, whatever. I feel like um, what you've done is you've inspired this person. All right. To be in their alignment. So let's just see what the next 30 days looks like for you guys. They see it moving forward for sure. New beginnings. You're in, you're an inspiration, Virgo. Next 30 days. All right. So, um, if you guys have been kind of shaky, like if you've talked to this person about healing or, or move, not moving fast, um, I, I, I will say that this person has probably felt a little, um, a little left out in the cold, but they're going to actually wake up from this. All right. And realize why you've had to it, maybe even possibly pull back your energy. All right. Um, but they are waking up to the realization of, of what you've been trying to say. If you've had this conversation, if this conversation has not taken place yet. All right. Just know that this might need to take place um, in order for you guys to grow and level up. All right. Yes, they'll feel a little bit abandoned by you, um, but they're going to see that this is um, a forward moving change that needs to happen. All right. For some of you with the page of swords coming out, 
I almost feel like this is delayed news coming out on your end because maybe some of you guys haven't talked to this person yet and you need to speak your mind. You need to tell them um, why it's important not to move fast, why it's important not to be hasty. How come um, quite possibly some of their past relationships didn't work out, right? So um, I'm going to leave it right here, Virgo. I hope you guys will comment. Let me know who this is sitting with. Um, I love seeing... Um, I love seeing you guys resonate with my videos, so I will talk to you guys soon.